it's John aka the Brick Guy here again today. Today we're reviewing the Marvel Studios first ten years. Captain America Civil War, Captain America and Crossbones. Uh yeah. I'm gonna judge this more heavily because of the price. Because the price is fifty dollars. Fifty that's a lot for an action for two action figures. So I'm going to judge it more heavily. Bring them out. <laughs> Steve out his head. His shield. Okay, let's go. Captain America action figure. Meh. Meh. Don't know why I'm actually going meh, because it's actually a good figure. I mean, the detail, again, on these expensive figures, the detail is freaking fantastic. He has a shield. Oh, it actually kind of hurt. Actually, it may have a Good plastic. Not even sure this is made of plastic because it's a good material. And so there you go. He can hold a shield like that. Like that. After a man can hold a shield. Ah. Uh, hold on. I position my camera. Ah. Uh, you can. You can take off his head. Good boy. It's gonna be a doozy. Oh, there we go. Okay, that just looks weird right there. I found his head. And you pop his real head on. <coughs> it's gonna be a struggle. Oh boy. This is the thing I don't like about action figures. It's because when it, it comes to swapping out heads, they're always a pain in the butt. Ugh. That just won't snap on. Oh, there we go. There we go. Finally got his head snapped on. After minutes of struggling, I guess I'd snapped on. His belt is loose. I don't like that. But I do like how they used it. Yeah, this figure, I'll say, is, is a nice figure. Just wish it wasn't so hard to take the head off and put it back on. But yeah, this is Captain America. If that Captain America cut was a long time, but here is Crossbones. Honestly, the reason I got this is for the Captain America. Now that I'm holding them in the, my hands, I actually like Crossbones better. Holy cow. He just looks sick. All the detail, though. All the detail. I can take off that um has his helmet. I guess you can pull off. Oh boy, there we go. That actually came off easier than caps. Put this head on. Oh, there we go. Oh, it was really easy. So I'll give this. It has fantastic printing up there or paint. I just love how they did this figure. So, <clears throat> uh, yeah, that's Crossbones. Uh, he also has that <clears throat> kind of pistol, I guess, in his pocket. Yeah, that's Crossbones. Uh, 
real quick, I just want to uh, do some poses with these guys. Some pose. Here's another pose. Here's another pose, but this one you have to hold. Okay, now here's the packaging. It's okay, packaging. Uh, here's the box. It looks very sleek because these are like supposed to be collectible, so I understand why. Uh, I'll read this right now. Captain America, the America's first super soldier, Captain America, must decide if he stands by his government in the aftermath of a disastrous strike on Nigeria. Crossbones, a, a Hydra agent and formal double agent at S.H.I.E.L.D. Crossbone makes his mission to take out Captain America, no matter the loss of life at stake. Okay, that was actually really nice information, as if you want information on them. Overall, I give them a B minus. I mean, the detail and the material is high quality, but like the fifty dollar price point is what brings it down mostly. It's that fifty dollar price point. If it was just forty dollars, if it was just thirty dollars or thirty five. I will give it more of a higher grade. But yeah, that's all for today. Rick blessings and goodbye.